Hey everybody, the Bong is here, and welcome to another stream at the Sanctum. Today is September 2nd, 2018. We are on Labor Day Eve, pretty much. So we're going to continue on with some more Castlevania Harmony of Dissonance for the Nintendo Game Boy Advance. And I'm at the point of the game where I can actually start exploring more of the castle. Because I'm just appearing on what? A certain side of it? I think I'd rather stick with the uh, Bible and the uh, lightning book. This is a good spot to get some money. Like as soon as you leave and re-enter, just hit both those candles and they'll give you 100 gold each. Hello Karina, glad you can make it. The stream only started, so you didn't miss much. So yeah, this good spot here gets you 200 gold each pass. I don't want to bore you all with me just getting money, so why don't we just continue? That poison lizard actually hurt me. Because of the uh, poison damage. I gotta be a little bit more careful fighting these guys. They seem pretty tough, too. Alright, so... What can I get here that's of importance to me? Do I think I'll play Smash Bros. on here at some point? I don't know. Anything can happen. Well, almost anything can happen. Increases the strength of the Sacred Fist. I mean, I might as well buy it. I may not use it, but it's there. Do I want a Morion? It's a helmet that gives me extra defense. Also, it comes with a neck guard. It's always good to keep your neck safe. Otherwise, you die. How many potions should I get? I think I'll get this many. Like, we'll stack up a, a little bit. I think that's good for now. Alright, so, where exactly is my destination? Other than just scouring this place. Again, I'm not a fan of, like, a uh, baby blue and lime green on this, but it's there. Also, I don't think I need this on anymore. What did I buy last time? I'm trying to remember what it was. Oh, it's actually on head. The Morion. Yeah. It sounds like Moron. That's obviously not it at all. What else should I put on there? Maybe go back to the Lucky Ring? Or maybe I should get something that boosts intelligence. So I like my intelligence to be a little bit higher. Do I have anything for that, though? I don't think I do, except for the night goggles. And that seems like a waste of an equipment slot. You know what, let's go with Lucky Ring. I can get more drops. And maybe more crits this way. Get out of here, you jerk. Nobody likes you. You are literally toxic to everybody. In fact, that's what poison is. That oh, looks like a painting or drawing. But I'll take it. It's there. And there's the elevator. Do I need to go in here? Well, might as well save. Might as well just check out the rest of this place. Oh, it's another Minotaur! 
it's you again. This time he has a ball and chain. This guy is not good at fighting. <laughs> All right, you're gonna get corner fricked right now. I'm just getting him like right in the kneecap. Should have put some uh, knee guards on or something. And he gets utterly destroyed. I, I like how his head comes off, even though I've been mostly hitting him in the knees. There we go. He was got dusted. We got the steel tip. What's the steel tip again? Oh, okay, probably just makes my whip stronger. Wind book in the next room. I actually already have the w the wind book. I just like the bolt book better right now. I don't intend on changing. Because why fix what isn't broken? Oh, there's some armor there, as well as a door. But I can't open that door yet. Yeah, I think the steel tip is just for straight damage. Also, I find out, though, the yellow book was actually part of a trial, so I'm kind of glad I'm sticking with that one. Otherwise, I did that trial for nothing. That's not what I'm all about. It's got to have a greater purpose in life, you know? Did I not get that square? Oh, I'm missing this, too. An elixir. We'll definitely take that. I like things that keep me alive. Because <laughs> the alternative sucks. Is this the way I want to go? I can go... Right. It'll take me down there. But should I go that way? You know, we'll, we'll stick to going this way. There's a Gorgon over here. I need to be able to open that door somehow. I'm just missing a few components. Luckily, I know what those components are. In case anybody's worried that I actually don't know. I just don't have them all yet. I think this door over here also needs the key. But I'm not sure. It's this one. Yeah, it is. Okay. I don't have that key. We'll come back to that later. Okay. This seems easy enough. There's a holy ring. Is that worth anything? This ring's holy powers make it hard for curses to be cast on user. I mean, thanks, I guess. All I can do is just try not to get cursed. That seems easy enough, right? <laughs> Okay, there's nothing else here. 
Might as well just fill in some map. That's probably the most tedious part of, like, this little dungeon. All the map filling in you gotta do. But you gotta do it in case there's an item right on that square. Okay, that, that, that entire sector is done. Do I want to keep going left? I mean, I might as well. Looks like there's nothing else here. Master Lizard. Ow! At least I can just use this spell right next to him. And that'll work for me. Oh, he can block that spell, too! So I gotta be extra careful when fighting Master Lizards. Get away from me. Well, he thought wrong, because he's dead. Oh, alright. Hearts. I can use hearts. Except I've kept spell books on the whole time, so I've never been consuming hearts in a long while. Yeah, I'll go up. That's a dead end. Skeleton flail. More like skeleton fail, am I right? These masters are actually really strong in this. Heaven's Ring. Hello, Night Fox. Glad you can make it. What ring did I get again? It was the uh, Heaven's Ring. Oh, it just increases the strength of the axe. That's fine, I guess. Um. <laughs> uh, let's see. Hands, maybe. Maybe I could use more defense. I think we'll go with more defense for now. And now we shall continue. Oh, it's that Spriggan again. We only fought one earlier. But that was all the way back. Oh, I thought he was going to slide at me again. He was certainly going to try. I think this way leads to a shop. And it's actually open! Good! This magical necklace makes its user wiser. It unless I sell something awful. Well, I suppose I can sell the turquoise. You can only sell gems. You cannot sell old equipment. And now I know. I think we'll forego luck for now. And we'll go with the uh, magic necklace. It doesn't give me that much intelligence, but hey, I'll take it. I thought it would give me more than that. 
greater my intelligence, the better my spells will be. Where's the next save point to? Down there? Oh, it's all the way to the left. I suppose I'll go down this way first. Sword is tanky. Breed amulet! So now I look like a pimp. Increases its user's luck in finding money. I mean, depending on where you're to, you pretty much guarantee yourself money. So I don't think that greed amulet's gonna help me. Is this where I can find a save point? Nope, that's... That seems to be a room I never opened. Have I not been able to get in there before? Oh, it was like this kind of door. And I didn't open it from the other castle either. How did my magic miss that? Alright, teapot and a teacup. So we're making the set for Beauty and the Beast now. That was like how I wanted to live my uh, Sunday. I kind of prefer the uh, the wind book out of the, those two. Even though they're both really useful, that was the one I kind of preferred. As far as water goes, if you have the, uh, the sacred fist with that, you can probably uh, sequence break your way to some items. If you did it just right. As far as the wind bolt goes, I usually prefer the, uh, the fist for that as well. Because it's shot like a fucking energy ball. And that energy ball can, like, tear through a lot of things. Well, not the most powerful spell you could use. It certainly was creative. This one over here just allows me to dash through for almost everything. Ah, oh, I thought I could dash backwards at that time. Wouldn't let me. Whatever. Is this the way I want to go? Yes, it is. I don't know if I should go through the Skeleton Cave first, or the Luminous Cave first. It's hard to say. Both are viable options. Oh wow, this room looks a hell of a lot better. Let's see... I'm missing a few more things, though. 
So apparently, when I get all the items, this room will look like something from Hoarding Buried Alive. Gotcha. Not a very positive message, but it exists. Let's go Luminous Cave first. Just hope I'm not wrong. Man, these sylphs are pretty strong. They look nothing like the sylphs you see in the Tales games. They were actually a little bit less annoying, believe it or not. These definitely seem pretty strong compared to the witches. Man eaters, believe it or not, have not changed at all. And that's good because I never liked those. Oh, you like this part of the game? Just like the cave in general? I wouldn't say this is my favorite part. I kinda like the uh, aesthetics of the skeleton cave, but that's just me. Wait, does this give me 400 bucks each time? Oh, the collectibles. Okay. It was an interesting part of the game. Oh yeah, this does give you 400 gold each time. That's actually pretty neat. Slow, but it's... It's neat. Because you have to go all the way from one end of the room to the other just to get it. Can't say I'm a fan of that part. Okay, if I go this way, it just leads to a dead end. Kind of want to go that way. Actually, I don't think I should go this way because that's water. How deep is the water? Ah, uh, it's not that deep. Okay, now it, now it's deep. Never mind. I'm I'm turning back. I don't have gills. This is not the place for me. This would have been better if my mom was a fish. Might have been able to get through then. Now, should I go? I think I should. Hmm. Well, I don't think it really matters. But I think I can go. Upper left now. Look, Knife Flop Fox. If my mom was secretly a mermaid, I still would have been able to find my way through. And I wouldn't have drowned. So we're only doing this just so I can, like, fill in that spot in the map. But at least we, now we have another warp point to use. So that's really helpful. Ooh, I want to get that. What is it? Oh, it's a full helmet! Do I want to wear the full helmet? Yes, I do. Now I want to check out this room. Oh great, more bats. I guess the game will never let me be done with them. At least they are 
I can cut through them like a hot knife through butter. So there is some uh, silver lining to all this. point of this room is. There's nothing there. Another medicine jar. So that's nice, I guess. But if I'm not a person to use the medicine jar, then, well, obviously it's not that nice at all. Maybe I'll find a reason to use it. Could very well be useful. I mean, my playstyle can be a bit reckless when I'm trying to speed through it. But do I want to go... You know what, let's go right. There's another boss here. Oh, never mind. I'm fighting a different boss now. Talos. That's one of the gods in the Elder Scrolls. He big boy. He got a bum shin there. It's been like Cotton Hill. he can turn his hand into different things. Other than that, he doesn't seem like a very hard boss. Funny how you mentioned that, Night Fox. I'd never beaten Skyrim. And I sold my copy of Skyrim for like 10, 15 bucks because it was the PS3 version. And that version is kind of like hard to do, like when you're very late into it, because saving takes a hundred years, and sometimes it might crash on you. There, we did it. Now, we can see what's at the end of this room. No, we can't! I can't jump that high! I am not the Mario. In fact, I don't even think Mario can reach that high. Long story short, the Dominion was wrong. Well, I mean, it, that's up for interpretation. What I feel is wrong is anybody that tells me that Conjuration is a shitty skill to use in Skyrim. Because that is how you can have unlimited arrows. I also got my first hint card. Somewhere there exists a mechanism for draining the caves. Well, let's go find it then. Okay, maybe the mechanism should be somewhere at the very bottom? That would make the most sense to me. Hey lady, are you the mechanism? I guess not. How do they fit money in these candles, anyway? I feel like that should never be possible. And yet somehow it is. I don't have a key. Was 
Was I supposed to find a key somewhere else? I think I was. You have a key? I don't think you do. Ceramic mail. Armor crafted from material that modern alchemists can't comprehend. Oh, that that's way too expensive for me. I feel like out of the two caves I could have gone through, I chose the wrong one. So now we gotta go around the long way to find the freaking key. Isn't life great? But somehow you're presented with two choices and you get the first one wrong. At least he dropped some money for me. Guess out of goodwill. <laughs> Is this the way I want to go? Is that the way out? Yeah, that's the... Oh, hold on a sec. Oh, no, wait, that's the part with the water. Yeah, I'm gonna leave that part out for now. Now let's go check out the skeleton cave instead. Oh, I thought you were dead for some reason. That goes to show how much I know about women, am I right? Like, I can't read the room to tell if they're dead or not. Maybe that's why it's been a hard time for me to find a girlfriend. <laughs> I find that sometimes... Women can be obviously very sweet, compassionate human beings. And then other times, they're like the seventh color on a Rubik's Cube. If you know exactly what I mean. So, impossible to solve. Also, I found a phonograph. Hello, Kinjiru-chan. Glad you can make it to the stream. Maybe it'll be a bit longer one than usual because, well, I don't have to work tomorrow, thankfully. Arthro-skeleton. Oh, alright. Basically an evolved form of a spider-skeleton. I think I can do something about the other side of that wall. Oh, whoa, I didn't know you were here. I don't want that cross. I can do without it. Yeah, last time I was here, there was a dead end on the left side. So I guess if I go to it now, might be able to break it open. I don't know. If skeletons are throwing their bones at you, is that considered self-harm? I'm only asking the important questions here. This is where we come to learn about ourselves. I, 
I would say likely two Night Fox. But then here's the other part of the question. Is it still considered self-harm if skeletons are unable to feel? Oh, I remember this part. This, you have to like work with both boxes. Luckily, that should not be an issue. Well, I mean, look at it, Nightbox. If it's just all skeletons, are there any nerve endings? Usually what you feel is tied to your nerves. Especially, like, to your brain. But if there's no brain, is there any sensation of pain at all? What about emotions? Well, again... How do we know if skeletons have emotions at all? Hey James, glad you can make it. I love as soon as you show up, the first thing you bring up is like, hey, I finally got my gaming laptop. Even though I never asked about it. And I did see it on Discord, by the way. No, I can still get up there. I thought I couldn't for some reason. Yeah, but once you get here, the uh, skeleton cave is a predominant puzzles. I'll send you the link to my Discord, like, later on, on uh, Twitter. Okay, Night Fox? Also, that's where the red skeletons are coming from. They come from statues that cry blood. Oh, I, th I thought you did for some reason. Never mind. Hang on a sec, I'll, I'll put a link to the Discord right here if you want to join. Just give me a sec there. There you go, you just click on that and you're good to go. All I can say is just, just don't be a dick on it, that's all. It's just common sense. Here is where I want to go. So I shall. There's another boss? Oh, it's Legion again. Looks like there's going to be a little bit more intricate to, to open this thing. had to hit that corpse over there. The more you hit the outer part, the longer this thing stays open, I think. This boss is not too hard, actually. I think I should take the crushing stone off. I 
Actually, I'm trying to think this spell is not very good here. You grew out of Twitter, so you go to Discord instead. I always find that hilarious. Anyway, we got the Cypher's Charm. What the hell does the Cypher's Charm even do? Is it equipment? Speeds up the rate at which MP are restored. Honestly, that's really good. Now I can use spells more often. And honestly, I'm glad you grew out of being control. There's really no reason to do that. Oh, I think I need your help. And there's another hint card. Do I have all the hint cards? I think I do. They say there is a book with the power to summon monsters. I shall go look for it then. Also, we found the rare ring. I think it makes it easier to find, like, rare items from enemies. I don't know how practical it is in the long run. But I guess we'll find out. Oh god, I remember this room. This room was a giant ass puzzle. So what I need to do is find a way to get up there. Create a few boxes that I can actually guide over this way. Actually, it looks like I might only need one. But, by the looks of it, if I put two boxes down here, I still can't move that third one. But, I do have bit of a solution. If I push this down here... And then do this... Push this down... here... Okay, I think I might have figured it out. I hope. Let's see if I got it. Push it down like this. bit of an issue, because I can't push that. Everybody relax, I'm a professional, alright? I know what I'm doing. May not always seem that way, but I certainly do. So all we know is, 
We can't just push this one down here. But what I can do... I can push this one over here like this. And then create a staircase like this. Do that. Is it gonna line up the way I want? Hope I didn't push that second one too much. Nope, I didn't. We're good. Just required a little bit of forward thinking. And there's the floodgate key. Now I gotta go all the way back. Well, I wish I didn't have to. Oh well, at least we got that sorted. I wish this section was a little bit more open, but until I get the upgrade that I need to go all the way up, I can't. Yes, Nightbox, I still hate bats. Thankfully, these bats are just too easy. It's just that there happens to be plenty of them. I keep forgetting I have a dive kick. Never found a practical use for it, though. One thing I wish this game had was, like, an item that had, like, the ability to send you to a warp room instantly. Like the last one that you used. I wish they had that so that you didn't have to trek so much. Just to save you a little bit of time, you know? Would have been a bit thoughtful. Of course, they couldn't really do that. They want to make you work for it. But, oh well. It is what it is. Bats jump you when you least expect it. Exactly. Even though you can easily expect it here. Because they glow so much. It's like, hey, we're over here. We're going to fly towards you now. Oh shit, we're dead. Because we're weak. <laughs> oh, almost lost that. Alright, so I gotta go all the way to the deep part of the caves, so I can use that floodgate key. And I wish I knew to go to the skeleton cave first. But sadly, I am not the smart. There's a coin toss and I flip wrong. I have no other avid description other than that. 
just gotta remember to keep going. At least I'm leveling up like crazy. So I have that going for me. Which way was it to the mechanism again? It was... Okay. Go left, right, and then go to the little room on the left. That I do know. Oh yeah, this uh, new accessory I got is working wonders. To have my MP charge up so much faster... ...makes things a hell of a lot more fun. Make magic spam more viable. It knew what we want. That is gross. But now we can go back to the room where the water was. And he actually will not drown. Or worse, get our boots wet. Because that's when pneumonia sits in. And man. Either you die or you get pneumonia, so either way, you don't win. How much health do I have? I can't take a hit worth 86. Gotcha. 86 is like the last two digits of the year that I was born. And knowing my taste in video games, some of you probably think I was born in 1886. And you'd be wrong. I was born in 1786. <laughs> Except not really. In case anybody actually believes it. Uh, yes, Night Fox. Believe it or not, I am 31. And I will be 32 in 17 days. Like, literally just a half month away from my birthday. Which is absolutely crazy. Oh, leggings. Before they became a trend for the Starbucks crowd. My home is not really big enough to have a crowd for a party. So, I hate to disappoint you there. Oh, hey, Death. I shake my fist at you, Death. I'm. You're making me angry. I guess we're just gonna have to fight now, huh? I'm on to your light show. Seriously, uh, Death, you need to trim that scythe a little bit. It's getting a bit too long. 
need to see a groomer for that or something. Wow, Death, you're a bit of a pushover. But he's not done. Hey, come to me. Don't worry about that tail. We can't do anything about that. We can get tail another time, alright, magic spells? But now's not the time. This is why you buy a bunch of potions, guys. I can go for a ride on the death train. It's like the soul train, only it's dead. Wow. Alright, I see how it is. This is good. The Griffin's Wing. Now if I hold down and hit up and jump, I am able to go as high as I can. So even the highest lengths, I can reach easily. I hate this guy so much. Because they block so much. And I don't want to fight them. Keep forgetting I had to switch back to the steel tip. Alright, why don't we go back to that area I couldn't reach before? That was after the Talos battle. Go see what's in there. Uh, it's just up that way. Alright, cool. I like how that flooded area actually still has no enemies in it. Which shows that they don't just immediately occupy a place that's dry. Maybe they just hate water that much. That even any trace of it is dangerous to them. Alright, let's see what's in the rest of this room. So we never got to visit it. That's all? Okay. Sure. But what else is in here? I don't know you can do this in midair, too. That's a dude with a hammer. He's literally called Hammer Hammer. In Arya Sorrow, there was like a dude that only had hammer in his name once. Oh, there's a skull key. We need that for some of those doors. So now we're good to go. And I broke my ankles. Great. 
It's like my ankles are pretty much into my eye sockets. That's how heavy the impact was. I find it sad that they never really gave Hammer Hammer much love. Cause what, is this the only time you see him? And then I don't think he shows up again? Or if he does, it's really late. Is this where I want to be? I mean... Shh, no. What about over here? I think I should go this way. Oh, I can't break that. Well, at least I can fill in that spot on the map. Wait a minute, what else can I do? I can do something down the bottom. Suppose I'll do that now. But is that necessary for me to do now? I mean, I might as well. Because it looks like I can. So I will. Is this the right place? Nope, I gotta go further down. the room? No, it's just one below it. Well, it's a good thing I just got that skull key. Wait a minute. Why do I feel like I can break that? That looks suspicious. Okay, you can't break that. And that sends me back here. Is this where I want to be? I mean, there's no reason for me not to be here. Seems I haven't really been everywhere in this room. Wait a minute. I know about this room. There's a relic I couldn't reach. Get it now. The Vlad's ring. What does that do? Oh, it increases luck. I think if you have the ice book and the fist, you can get this this relic rather early. So that's pretty neat too. Let's just keep going and look around. Okay. Up and left. Gotcha. Bad bonga, no sequence breaking. Keep in mind, I did not get the ring, so obviously I did not sequence break at all. I'm just giving an idea for anybody that wants to be a rebel. Oh, where's their fire book? And summer clothes. You know, I figured I'd get some summer clothes now because, well, summer's almost over. Hey, I'm only think I'm a rebel, I can be whatever you want me to be. As long as it's legal. <laughs> okay, I 
think I have an idea where I need to go. Or at least an idea where I can go. Is this somewhere I need to go? No, I don't think it is. Pretty sure I got everything in here, but let me look. Just in case I couldn't reach it. Let's see. I think we'll go back to the castle entrance. Yeah, I think up here is good. So it looks like there's that spot to the left that I could not reach before. And it's another warp! Fantastic! There's also this room. The Platinum Tip! Video stopped. No, it didn't. Try refreshing on your end. Uh, can can somebody in the chat tell W. Choi to refresh? Because it looks like the stream's fine on my end. It might just be his internet. Who knows? Thanks, Night Fox. Uh, okay, down here. Yeah, I might as well fill in that spot on the map. So it looks like I can now. Kinda is. Looks like there's this one passage over here. Oh, seems I've still missed the necessary item to break that. I'll have to come back to that later, too. Anything about those doors just yet. But soon I'll be able to. I'm missing the crush boots. I love how you uh, gave me a hint as to what item I missed. Despite the fact I've already figured out that I'm missing something. The fact that I wasn't able to break that ceiling was a dead giveaway right there. <laughs> it's like pointing it out after the fact. Hindsight's 2020, y'all. Obviously, I just need to look for them. And yes, yeah, so try your best not to spoil the game, you know? Because some people in here might not be knowing that this is happening. I haven't saved in a while, I'll do that. Wow! Yeah, just knock me into the next area. 
see how it is. It's okay, Cho W. Choi. Just try not your best not to do that too much. Like, you can still participate in the chat, just as long as it's not heavy on spoilers, you're good. There's the lurk key. Oh, that was a key I was probably looking for for those other doors. So I think we can almost open... Maybe we can open every door. Clear bone. Basically, a skeleton that is obviously translucent. So I gotta be careful with those. Because I can only hit them when they become opaque again. Oh! Apparently, a, an enemy that was a boss is a standard enemy here. He's dead. I wonder if he just comes back. No, nope, there's just another one. Come at me, devil bro. Let me walk with style. <laughs> Now it just feels weird exploring this place all over again. Two di three different kinds of lizard men in this room, that's weird. Ah, so uh, changes in elevation is the weakness of Master Lizard Man. So there's a health upgrade over here. Oh god, Bonga. But what? I don't know what you're talking about. Do you mind when I hear this response, knowing that the chat could have some delay? I have no idea what people are reacting to sometimes, if I don't get a specific context. Uh, yeah, you know what, I should probably explore that little room over there. Oh, you're playing a fishing game. It's not Ultimate Fishing Simulator, is it? Because I received a Steam key from that a few days ago. I think it's still out on beta. If I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure these armors are not going to get any victories anytime soon. Went through all that to get some curtains. Zero. Hey, that little ball on his head is a bomb. Like Master Baller, but it's about fishing. I don't even think you use balls as lure. Then again, I don't understand that much about fishing. Oh, 
Oh, Master Bader. Look, I have the, uh, my secondary monitor, like, a couple feet from me. So it looked like Master Baller, not Master Bader. Oh my god. I always like how there are little balls that just explode. Man, imagine hearing that out of context. Come at me. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that, that was obviously on purpose. They couldn't have been that tone deaf to not know what it meant. That would have made them even worse. Hike Master. Whoa, he gave me that good stabbing. You get the beta rank if you only use rods, no nets, or other gear. Clearly the best master baiters only use their rods. Na 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 na. <laughs> Ooh, a Twilight Cloak. Oh man, I'm gonna turn into like a uh, Robert Pattinson now. Um, is it here? Let me take off the Guardian Glove. A pitched black cloak that creates an air of darkness around its user. Does offer me more defense and luck. Yeah, let's put that on. Oh, look at my dash now. It's actually darker. So I basically have a long hair Nuke Saiba chasing me. That's pretty cool. I always like those little aesthetic things there. Shows how much they care about what they do with this game. Uh, am I filling out this entire room? Looks like I am. Looks like I'll go right. Trick along too deep. Oh, there used to be a hard upgrade in the A part, but in the B part, it's a flea man. A Viking helm? Oh, that reminds me, I have to wait till November for the show Vikings to come back. I think they're on the sixth season now? Or maybe the fifth. No, I think it's definitely the sixth. I don't like waiting for it. Because it's such a good show. Oh yeah, I knew that Viking Helms actually had no horns. Then again, Castlevania is not meant to be an authentic telling of history. I guess I can go this way now if I want to. Let me just fill in that square. Yeah, I think that's good for now. The church might hear you. The churches have ears.
You think The Undertaker will confront Shawn Michaels tomorrow on Raw? I don't know. I don't even book the show. And even if I did, what impact would that even make? Personally, I haven't watched a full episode of Raw in like a long while. Because it's on so late where I'm to. By the time it's over, it's 12.30. And I don't think I can sit through like an episode of Raw that has like commercials for three hours. I can get this easily. Just pretty much on a pedestal. They really wanted me to get this. Also, this room just gives me free 250 bucks. All I have to spend is seconds of my time to keep picking it up. One enemy can do over a hundred damage. Why do these owls look so weird, too? Uh, do I want to go left? You know what? I, I might as well go left. Looks like a dead end there. Ooh, a candle holder. Why do I need a candle holder? I, I, you can put candles in my room easily. Seems like a waste of space. The smiling statue, eh? I didn't notice much of a smile. Okay, so this guy can still hit me even if I'm ducking. Good to know, I guess. I thought if I ducked, the whip would go over my head. Ooh, what's this? Crush boots! I think I'm supposed to actually wear these. Um, uh, get rid of the full helmet. Actually, I don't think I need to equip that until I find something I can break. But that is odd that it's not actually a relic, but rather an active piece of equipment. That's a shame. Oh look, it's that owl from Ocarina of Time. Now he's dead. <laughs> uh, right? Yeah, we'll go right. I don't have to commit to the whole path, though. Though we easily could. Random useless fact, my butt itches. Yeah, you're right, it was random and useless. I did not need to know that. Can't open that from here, but I'll, I'm not gonna. Because I don't need to come back here yet. Probably wait till I get, like, all the other, uh, Dracula parts, and then I'll go. Jeez, even the owl hurts you pretty badly. Is it down here I can go? Yeah, it is down here. Oh yeah, I definitely have a good sense of humor. I, I try my best. 
JP Bone Pillar. I guess the JP just stands for jumping. So at least it's very descriptive. That yeah, descriptive as to what it's all about. I mean, though I think it's more likely bouncing than jumping. But who am I to judge? I'm just the dude that plays video games. Also, I think I'm supposed to go up here. How many of these things do there have to be, anyway? Just enough, it seems. I thought that guy was going to impale me with, on the head. That would have given me a splitting headache. In many ways. Also, I don't want that guy to kill me. Stark contrast in this room when, you know, the ghosts, the large ghosts, are actually super easy. And then you got the other enemies, like the JP Bone Pillar, which sounds like a great name for a lawyer, that utterly can annihilate you. It's funny how that works. Even the owl can be just a deadly killer. I'm getting some food. Damn, I gotta be more careful. Alright, I'm loading up on more potions. Just use the works of them for now. I'm just happy these guys can drop high potions, which are way better. What the hell? I was lied to by the game. I feel bad for any animal lovers here that see that little owl twitch whenever it dies. This guy. The Cyclops. Whoa! I thought I avoided that. At least his dash is easy to telegraph. Got its eye on me. Thankfully, not his shoulder. And now he's dead. <laughs> eh, that was cool, I guess. <laughs> Alright, now I made it back here. Seems as I made it back to the castle entrance. I can't make good use of those crush boots now. But would be better to do it from the A side or the B side. Technically, I can do both.
Like, these rooms over here, I think, are guaranteed to lead to warps. So that's helpful, I guess. Let's go back to the A side. Go take care of that little cubby up there. Uh, we'll take that off for now. Grab all this stuff. All that stuff with the mana as well. And we got magical armor. How good is the armor anyway? Okay, this armor affects its user's spirit. MP consumption rate is reduced. It lowers my intelligence, but you know what? I think we're good with that. What did I have on instead? Oh yeah, the Cypher's Charm. Let me put that back on again. Man, those were uh, money candles, weren't they? They are. Good. I like money. <laughs> Speaking of money, you can always send some through Streamlabs. Help support your uh, local streamer, or at least this one. <laughs> but use use that to get me some uh, other stuff. Also, I went the wrong way. Was that Cypher in the stained glass? Honestly, I don't know. That would be very weird, considering there's like a portrait of. Somebody that was an enemy to Dracula in Dracula's castle. That would be very weird. It's like, I admire this missus that was involved in killing me before. Like, why would you do that? And that you do, Night Fox, which I greatly appreciate. <laughs> oh, I took the crush boots off, duh. Why do I have to keep putting them back on? Why couldn't they have just been a relic? Ancient urn. That's the rib of Vlad. Alrighty then. Has the power to negate poison. Okay, so I got the ring, the fang, the nail, the rib, and the heart. So the only thing I'm missing is I think that's the eye, but luckily I know where that's too. I think that's back at the chapel. So we got a little ways back to go. So let me go in that spot to get some war fatigues. Yeah, they can be all sweaty now. Though Troy, I think your stream's a little behind because, believe it or not, I just got it when your message showed up. Like, literally at that instant, which is so creepy. I 
This guy is so red. Wait, are you gonna throw your head at me? You gonna do it? You fail miserably. That's why you died. There's just one eye there, that's weird. Damn, getting lucky with the uh, money drops on this guy. Yeah, I see that blue spot. I mean, I'm not going there right away, because I'm kind of busy filling in these spots, too. I'm trying to manage my time a little bit here, alright? It's not easy to do with a, a giant castle that you gotta check out twice. Looks like we've filled in quite a lot, actually. Pop it open to see what I revealed from earlier. Just wonder what can make me go through all this trouble. Is this the one? Yeah, that's the one. Actually, you know what? I can probably do something else. Am I in the right spot? Um, kinda? There's still, like, that blue line over there. Might as well get rid of it the only way I know how. Just go here. Better be worth going through all this trouble. Walk armor. This armor restores its user's HP when in motion. Not worth it. Because, in context, I feel that if you're walking so much, it's just going to make you more tired. So I think that's kind of the opposite of what it's meant to do. In theory. I mean, it'll make my legs look stronger, but still. Yeah, I did. Okay. I think this path over here leads back to the aqueduct. No, oh, I want the money! Yay, I did it. See what's popping over that one room in the skeleton cave. I hope it's just not like a hard up or an HP up. Because that seems like a little too convoluted for one upgrade.
And I don't know why they do that. I don't know why I keep popping that candle when I know that's the fist. hurting again. It's not an infection, is it? Hope it's nothing serious. The bullet tip. Alright, that's cool, I guess. That's important. Actually, something about one of those, the one of those holes in the map is very suspicious to me, and I don't know why. Let's go look at that. Oh, someone didn't check their safety. Yeah, workplace accidents are a bitch. Sucks the area had to go through that. So I'm guessing what you hurt was what your hand, I guess. I'm just lucky I never had a workplace accident. But one time in school that I did have my hand. Or something like that. Just crush my fingers, but there was no break. Oh, a bullet! Jeez. That must have been frightening. Aha! I got the summoning tome and a Jar with a face on it. The wizard's urn. The hell is that? Is that a collectible? Well, I can summon a fairy with this. Okay, that's neat, I guess. Oh wow, that that's that actually does sound very frightening. Oh, the the fairy hits him with a hammer. Yeah, that could have been a lot worse for sure. Especially when you hear like so many accidents of like uh, guns being used irresponsibly. Considering how much damage they can do. I mean, we do have a firing range here in town, but I've never been in there actually. Nor do I have any plans to do so. Though I did throw axes once. That part was a bit of fun. Yeah, how are we doing for viewers so far? Wow, eight people! I mean, considering it's a Sunday, I didn't expect a lot of people show up. Sunday doesn't seem to be, like, the best kind of day for streaming. I'm gonna see what's, like, uh, above the save room now. Very curious. 
curious at this point. Uh, I'm not all that surprised, Joy. He's probably busy. Maybe watching a movie, who knows. Yeah, I've never been shot before. Thankfully, I hope I never do. Okay, there's a health up and a big mana prism. Uh, I am in the A castle, so I can still fill in that spot on the map. If I care to. It seems to be like you know, a big room over there that hasn't been filled in by either side. Let me take care of that hidden room over on the uh, top part of the castle. I should probably go to the chapel next, too. Get that last relic from Dracula. Again. Is this where I want to go? Obviously, yes. Honestly, I'm just glad at this point I have the keys to open every door. This one. Do I have crush boots still on? Yes, I do. I think I'll need them to get over here. Yeah, that's fair that your work has a high risk for it. But I still hope that that never happens to you again. Passage somewhere has opened. Thinking I've, I have an idea of what that passage is. Now I can open up this way. Chalice, wine in it. I guess you can put wine in it. There's no wine in it now. There's a Kaiser mail. Said to have been worn by emperors. Okay, so this armor is actually really, really good. I'll stick with a magical armor for now so I can use my magic more often. If I don't need magic, I can switch to the Kaiser armor. So either way, I have a plan. Where do I want to go? I think it's over to the right. That's not the right right. Is it this one? Nope. Is it this one? Yes. I want to go over here to get that one square that I've neglected for so long. And I don't know why. 
because I could have gotten that way earlier. And it had nothing anyway. I think I need to go through the chapel through Castle A. So let's do that. Like, literally right now. Saving myself some time doing this. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I have to go to the chapel for this. Hope I'm correct. I just gotta look everywhere to find it. Was it up here? Honestly, I feel like it could be up here or up somewhere else nearby. Okay, not this room. Up this way, either. Alright, guess I'm going back down and to the left. That's not over there. Nice. Mario his ass. Let's uh, continue on here. So yeah, we are pretty close to the end of the game. Like, really, really, really close. In fact, so close, I could consider ending it now. Even though I would not get, like, the best ending. Actually, I think I could. But I have to do it a certain way. This is the room that has the relic. Somewhere around here, I think. And I think up here? Yes, this is the one. The Eye of Vlad. We did it. We have... I think we have all the relics? We do. Negates Curses. Yep, that's a solid piece of equipment. Guys. I could have gone around from this side. I picked the long route for no reason whatsoever. Oh my god, I feel like an idiot now. 
Why did I take the long ass scenic route? What is wrong with me? <laughs> Whatever. I ain't gonna lose any sleep at night over it. Oh, I can fill in another square while I'm at it. Also, I think I should be in Castle A for this. Is this a spot? Yeah, that's a spot. Good. Might as well get it while I'm here. I'm surprised those witches can still take a beating. Good for them, I guess. That's empowerment for ya. <laughs> That square is now filled in. Seems like there's a little room over there. What's the best way for me to approach this without taking too long? Okay, I think I know a way. I pretty much filled in most everything else. Except for like this little part in the middle. Good for the most part, then. So let's just go back. This way. Okay, now I gotta go up. I know what warp I want to take. Is this the one? No. Is this the one? Yes, it is. I will check my phone later. I got things to do. Like save again! <laughs> Joke's on you, Poison Lizard! You cannot do what you want to do to me. At all. <laughs> Unless I turn that relic off. Which, why would I? I still wish they didn't use, like, light blue for, like, both castles completed. It's like the worst color scheme they can use. Other than using white. So it's not the absolute worst, but it's still bad. That's just another warp. Now I got the moon armor. And now I'm in here. Oh, wait a minute. I did it wrong. Nope, that's not it either. Is this it? Yes, that's it. 
Alright, so I think when I go take this warp, it'll be the sun armor in this room? It is. Okay. Now it looks like I'm in Castle B. I mean, there is still that one room over there. You know what? Fuck it. I'm not gonna bother with that room. It's too far away. I'm gonna just go in and do my thing, then. Thankfully, all I need to do is just go over there. Thanks to Dracula's remains, I can go this way. Now, I think I should put this on. You know what? Let's put this on, too. I don't need the crush boots anymore. I'll need this. They give you a lot of candles in case you need them. I guess I'm gonna have to fight you now. Yeah, you have some fighting you, Maxim. But at least I can knock you back if I have to. Oh wow, he homed in on me. And I'm almost dead. Holy crap. So much for me trying to muscle my way through. Why do I have this still on? I'm trying to fight off this uh, demon inside him. Oh no, I gathered the remains and Dracula showed up. But he's not finished! So I can finish him now. I think I can only get him in the head. This spell absolutely wrecks Dracula. But now we got another phase. This ugly thing right here. Watch out for eye laser, and he also has a claw. Luckily, the eye laser is easy to spot. He also has a heart on the side of his head. Now, I'm no biology expert, but I don't think you're supposed to have that. You know, I'm just... Throwing that out there. Yeah, good thing I got a lot of high potions. And I win.
Alright, sit back and enjoy the best ending. Oh, I still gotta control my character. One last excellent for the road. <laughs> And then the castle beams up into space. Am I alive? No! This is a figment of imag if you're a imagination. You've been dead the whole time. <laughs> She's got some color. Good for her. She's getting a little bit of, of a tan out in Transylvania. You might as well call it Tansylvania. Na 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 na. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry about it. You were never bitten. He doesn't have the guts to do it. Bickering already? And they all got whipped. Alright, so that's a Castlevania Harmony of Dissonance for the Nintendo Game Boy Advance. I mean, I didn't bother to get the 200% uh, because I felt it would have been a waste of time. Wouldn't have added anything extra to the game anyway. But at least we have Boss Rush unlocked if I wanted to do that. And I think you can play as Maxim too if you entered his name as your creator character. But you had to have beaten the game at least once. I personally would rather not do like a two of the same kind of game, like back to back. I like to mix it up with a little bit of variety now and then. Keeps everything fresh. Oh yeah, this game only came out in 2002. Wow. Oh, that was like 16 years off. Yeah, you got here, like, really late. But I'm glad you can make it at all. I didn't say, like, what game I was doing next. I just kept it under wraps. I mean, I got a little bit of runoff time. Why don't we do boss rush mode? Okay, unfortunately, I don't really get to do anything extra. I'll, I'll stick with the cross. Ah, oh, summer flu. That's never fun. By the way, I can't pause at all. So it's not like I can just go into what equipment I might have. I think my level is retained, except for maybe my amount of parts. Oh, 
Hopefully I can get lots of hearts doing this. My level was like somewhat below 50. So I think that should be a pretty stable amount. I win the boss rush before I died when I let's play this. But I guess we'll find out how far I can get now. Looks by using a button trick. I don't know, if it involves a trick, it might not be worth doing. Just wish they let you have the books right then and there. Hey, come on, dude, wake up. to you. Good thing I didn't catch my boomerang. At least this guy's not too hard. Then again, early bosses were pretty easy. Let's see how easy it gets the rest of the way. I feel like that laser should hit me. To be honest, I'm glad it's not. <laughs> Boss number four. Oh, it's this guy. Don't even try it, Golem. The reason why you're an ass is that I can only evolve you through trading. Good hit, even though I didn't get a lot, all of it. That helped a little, not much. I also gotta try not to using my uh, use my boss too much. All right, he's dead. Good! Deserved it! Too bad the uh, cool or excellent bonus didn't give you extra hearts. Dash away from him. Oh, I just ran to the tip of his axe when he died. I'll just throw a bone at ya, I guess. I destroyed all creatures! Took six minutes and seven seconds. Alright. I 
I'm gonna hit no. No, let's let's just do normal mode too. For kicks and giggles. I'm gonna use the axe this time. Alright, so uh, we're just gonna do boss rush again because, well, I can. Plus, I feel like the axe is slightly better against the giant bat. Not by much, though. Just consumes one last heart, but that's it. The thing I don't like about this boss, he only takes a couple hits and then he just turns into bats again. Slows the fight down. Bosses have more health now, too. Now that I'm in normal difficulty. I might be wrong, though. But I wouldn't be surprised if they actually do have more HP. It seems like that fight was longer. Oh yeah, this fight's definitely longer. Well, actually, I still can't notice. It's around the same time I finished that guy off before. I just kind of wish they gave you a normal mode from the start. So maybe I'd rather do that instead of easy. I wonder how many more bosses they added to normal. on that. <laughs> right, last phase. Yeah, let's see how you like that when I'm whipping your shins. I'll just whack, whack your good leg. Because <laughs> I'm that confident in myself. Left. Oh, the golem again. Could you have picked a better spot to like do that crushing attack? Cause you, they all missed me. Done. Oh, so much for spamming that attack. like a good idea at the time but apparently it wasn't and now I know yeah 
get it. Get it. Get it. Yeah. I don't know if I'll do a hard mode boss rush, though. We'll see. Well, at least you can tell it's not the last guy now, because the room is different. I have an axe, too. You Mario'd me, what the hell? gotta commit to that first sub weapon because that's the only one you get that's the devil all right time to fight the Satan oh damn I have no curse protection anymore Remember that. Oh, he's done. Missed a few axes there. All right, we're still going. Still going strong. They haven't killed me yet. guy. Oh, the giant merman. That one might prove somewhat of a modicum of a challenge. Especially if it summons his reinforcements. Okay, maybe not so much. And even more so now. Eh, it was cool, I guess. <laughs> Slime boy. It's gooey boy, he wants to fight, huh? I should move, I might get stuck. stuck here with a slime. I don't want to get stuck against the boss of 1-8 in Yoshi's Island, alright? That would not be a good time.
The axe is a little bit practical if you use against him. Alrighty then. Wonder how many more bosses are left. Oh, this is the last one. You can tell by the room. The, tur the Church of Legions Christ. <laughs> of Latter day Legions. <laughs> Laser hurts. And we finished boss rush on medium difficulty. I kneel to the crucifix now. It is a Sunday after all. <laughs> Retry, no. But we do have hard mode unlocked. Which is also a no. And that's it for the stream, everybody. It's been two and a half hours. A little less, because I started a minute or two later. But anyway, thank you all so much for coming. I don't know what the next game's going to be. I like to keep that a surprise. So thank you all for watching, and I shall see you next time.